Hello, my name's Sarah. I'm a Sensi consultant uh, in today's delivery day. So I've got nearly £500 worth of beautiful Sensi products in my kitchen. I'll give you a little uh, display. That's all sorted, ready for customers. This is all to sort. Um, amazing. And the best thing is today, the products that have been delivered are the brand new catalogue products. So it's all exciting. I just thought I would jump on really quickly um, to show you one of our new warmers, but more importantly, how to build a mini warmer up. So I'm gonna flip you around and hopefully you'll be able to see. So I can't flip you around. The mini warmer comes in two boxes. You'll get a base box and a shade box. It's always important to make sure that if you've got a glass shade, you have the um, base box that says glass mini. If you've got ceramic or metal, then that would say ceramic and metal base. The shades come wrapped um, in polystyrene and plastic. So this one in particular is called Crowned in Gold. It's one of our new minis. Um, I couldn't resist it, my kitchen's green, and I just thought, how stunning is that? It's got so much show, and it's got kind of an iridescent tinge to it. What we do to build it up is we'll open the glass mini warmer base. The bulb comes wrapped in bubble wrap. And then if we open this up, it's really difficult with one hand, so bear with me. Um, we'll find like the plug-in base. Obviously, we're in region two, so that's the UK, and the plugs come three pin, ready for a 240 mains socket if you're in region one they'll come two pin for your mains and likewise for region three so these come already um you can see where the base screws in they come already with a little rubber washer in there that normally is enough to stabilize the shade but sometimes some of the shades come with an additional washer that you would place around that base so i'm just going to turn you around there in order to do this we'll take the plug we add the bulb. Now it's really important to try not to touch the bulb. So what I do is I use the plastic bag to turn it around. Um, basically it's just so that you don't have any, um, like leave any oily residue off your, your hands on the bulb. So you can see that I'm using the plastic bag to hold it. Keeping the bag clear of the thread and we'll simply screw that into the threaded base. It's exactly the same process for a ceramic bulb. A ceramic base the bulb just screws in as well finger tight so no need to over tighten it and then all that happens is the base it's got a screw side just screws into the plug-in base that'll be the shade plugs into the base again finger tight there's no need to over tighten it and that's our mini warmer ready to plug in how beautiful is that though I, like, i'm glad i can catch the light to show you because it's just such a stunning stunning mini warmer so all I'm going to do is pop that into the plug now, if I can show you that. This is the um, the little base, so you can turn it on at the wall, it's already turned on, and then you can flick it on at the base to turn the shade off. We we'll always recommend that you use um, the, the switch on the unit to turn it on and off and not the switch at the wall, um, just to avoid any um, bulbs blown unnecessarily gorgeous little mini warmer just wanted to show you it i'm really really chuffed with it um it's a stunning warmer but i just wanted to show you how easy they are to build up remember you get a lifetime guarantee from sensi for all of our uh, electric products for any manufacturing faults so you've got absolute peace of mind that the product is guaranteed and replaceable and um they there's no guarantees about the temperature that actually melt at but they um, our wax is melted at a much lower temperature so particularly with the glass ones, um, the, ma the wax melts nice and slow, so you get that long-lasting fragrance throughout the day. Absolutely beautiful. That's it from me. I'm going to love you and leave you and open my other goodies. See you later. Bye!